The Battle of Two Sides of Lake Erie BGSU team hosting Mercyhurst College tonight and the contest was anything but your average college hockey game as our Tim McMahon, well, he found out. Whether by car or feet, fans flock to the Madhouse on Mercer for another night of BGSU hockey action. But this Saturday evening contest was unlike any before it. For 50 years, it was the collegiate and professional athletes that took to the ice here at the Bowling Green State University Ice Arena that were the main attraction. But this weekend, five decades into its existence, it's the ice arena itself that is a star. With Hall of Fame announcer and BGSU alum Doc Emmerich calling the game, Oh my goodness, getting a piece of that one. The birds took the ice. And among the Falcons legends in attendance were Hobie Baker Award winners George McPhee and Brian Holzinger. It's been a long time since I've been back here and it seems like uh, other than just some, some upgrades to the arena, the, the atmosphere hasn't changed one bit. A really neat feeling walking into the building today, one that I haven't had in a long time, sort of a a little bit of goosebumps. Always loved the energy in the building. The acoustics here were different than almost any building I've ever played in. It was really loud and it came right down on top of you. Also taking in the historic night were Nelson Emerson and Scott Pollock, who has seen many changes in the arena throughout his years with the program. And you see now the evolution of the, uh, the, in, the interior as far as the, uh, the artwork and of course the outstanding uh, video board. It's come a long way so oh. All good stuff. George McPhee joined it. It's great to have George back as well. I just love the fact that, you know, the arena's pretty full tonight. It's almost uh, it's almost full of capacity. And I think that's great for the players. It's great for the town of Bowling Green. Definitely great for the university. More than just a celebration of the arena, the event also was a chance for these greats to catch up and bond over their common experiences. You catch up with guys that not only you played with, but that have been here uh, prior to you, hear some of their stories, and just to catch up, it's great. My roommate that I had for four years flew in here from Calgary, Alberta. You know what, those are your best memories because college is special, and you know what, your best four years of your life for sure. The arena, of course, hosts more than just hockey games. It's also the place where figure skating champions Scott Hamilton and Alyssa Sisney got their starts. I do remember my sister and I would always, we would always put on music and we would perform and we would pretend that we were skating at the Nationals or skating at the Worlds and then years later I got to do what I imagined doing when I was here. I mean there's no better audience than a Bowling Green audience, you know, and all those years that we skated here and we come back year after year, everybody loved it because they're so knowledgeable and they're so appreciative of everything. So. It's great to be back and, and uh, celebrate this wonderful occasion. This is certainly a weekend that the students, fans, and alumni of BGSU will never forget. Here's to hoping for 50 more years of memories from the BGSU Ice Arena. From Bowling Green, I'm Tim McMahon.